This is a day off. Hey, and where did the sweets go? Oh, what should I do now? There is absolutely nothing to eat! Oh, Molly, don't get upset. We'll figure something out. What? Who destroyed me? Here you go, a mushroom. That should be enough. I don't want mushrooms! And if you really want to feed me, let's have a challenge! Each of you will make some sweets for me. I'm sure it will be fun. Let's start with the simple one. I want jelly. Jelly, you say? Well, come on. First of all, I'll need some m and m candies. I have a lot of them. Lots of candies in a variety of colors, and I will pour them into a bottle in layers. After which, I will fill the whole thing with honey. Just like that, color by color. Oh, look at these bright colors of candies. Isn't that wonderful? Done. And now, the honey part. Let's fill it up. Oh, so good. Imagine how delicious it will be. That's not all. I need to cool the bottle a little. To do this, we place it in a vessel with liquid nitrogen. It's certainly the best way at cooling my yummy. <laughs> wonderful. Now, Let's insert this bottle inside. Just like that. Perfect. It's done. I'm a genius. What have you got, Wednesday? <sighs> Boring. It doesn't even look like fun at all. I'll do something more unusual. I'll make the eyes go through the wall of the bottle. Then I'll add some potion, which will consist of mushrooms, chicken fingers, and of course, the base of the potion at all. Look how it boils. What do you want, Thing? Oh, I'm assigning you to keep an eye on the potion. We can't let it escape. We can't swim in there. It's food. What are your manners? And anyway, don't bother me. It's time to fill the marmalade ice with this jelly. I'm sure it'll be very tasty. Now, learn how to cool food after that. Oh, look at these colors. I usually don't like bright, but this is wonderful. Look at that. I have a potion for freezing everything. I'm just going to drink it and freeze it with my hands. Wonderful, isn't it? What thing? Yeah, high five. Huh, and your dad frozen. Ew, what have you done to your friend? Okay, poor hand, but how can I make jelly? I think I'll start with a milkshake. And then everything is simple. I can borrow a little cooking method from Tina the chef. Honey is really perfect for jelly, so why shouldn't I use it too? Oh, look at that. And then I will freeze it in the standard way with the help of cans. So Molly... Be ready to decide who won. We are ready. Ready? And I'll start with the jelly from the chef. It looks very bright and delicious. Oh, it's amazing. Both the taste and the color are luxurious. Well, now let's try this creepy mask from Wednesday. I hope it's not a real eye drop. Hmm, it's also very tasty. I didn't even expect it. There's the last jelly from the Sophie. It doesn't look that cool, but that doesn't mean anything. Ouch. McDonald's. Is this really the McDonald's cocktail? Oh, it can't be. What? Am I exploding? Ah! It was a joke. I'm all right, but Wednesday jelly wins. Oh, yeah? Justice has been served. I want french fries. Will you make it for me? Easily. I didn't know one extremely fun way to cut ordinary potatoes into the light slices. Electricity and a tennis racket will help you with this. Let's take some gloves. And here's electricity. And then, in a small matter of time, the potatoes will just need to be passed through the grid. Isn't that perfect? It's so original. Ta-da! It immediately spilled up and fried. Perfect. 
But this is not enough. Now I need to serve it beautifully. Look at this box. Just as I like it. And now let's add some ketchup. In the form of blood. I think it's very exquisite. Wow, and I'm cutting potatoes the old-fashioned way. However, for some reason, I still have a whole bunch of potatoes left. But nothing is coming out of it. Okay, the main thing is to put it in slices. And they need to be thoroughly fried in oil so that they look like the same french fries from McDonald's. Oh, so perfect. Okay, let's pour it in the box. Ooh, I think I overdid it with the oil. Ah, so what? The main thing is the taste. What about the chef? And I won't make potatoes. I'm going to make banana fries. Molly definitely hasn't tried this yet. To do this, the bananas need to be dipped in a sweet batter. Then dipped in boiling oil. But that's not all. To make the bananas even tastier, I'll dip them in chocolate and then in colored sprinkles. Oh, it's going to be amazing. Now it's definitely going to be delicious. Look at that. Isn't that perfect? I think Molly will be thrilled. Girls, get ready to lose. We're done. And again, everything looks very cool. But where to start? Oh, I think the first thing I'm going to do is try these softened potatoes. From Sophie. Ew. Why so much oil? It's disgusting. Okay. Ooh, what about these potatoes from Wednesday? They look classic. Hmm. Incredibly delicious! I really liked it. Well, there's some suspiciously thick potatoes left from Tina the Chef. Unbelievable. It's very tasty, Tina. I'm thrilled. I've never tried banana fries before. Happy victory to you! Hooray! Girls just don't get mad, come on. Uh, easy on me. In the third round, cook a burger for me. I want something more serious here. It's easy for me. First, I'll need minced meat. Naturally, it's fresh, so I'll make it right now. Okay. But just making minced meat is not all. You need to beat it off properly to make a cutlet. Which can then be loaded into the pan. Oh, just like that meat. Get it. Perfect. I'm done here. Now, let's put it on this wonderfully beautiful pan with oil. It's boring. I'm going to have a spider burger. By the way, I'll make a cutlet for him in the toaster. No one has ever done this before, but it's really brilliant. You can't forget about the sauces and cheese and vegetables too. But first, let's put the cutlet, cheese, salad, tomato, cucumbers, a bun on top, and two eyes with tomatoes. <laughs> oh, that's terrible, honey. You're gonna need more fresh vegetables than that. Look, we're gonna use tomatoes, onion, cheese, and another bun on top. Look at this perfectly huge wow. burger. Wow! You really have everything so delicious, but I don't have anything yet. I urgently need to do something about this, and I even know what. I'll make a sweet burger for Molly, even if you. I use cakes and chocolate as buns, marmalade as filling, and it's perfect. It's still a burger, but it's just sweet. Oh, I'm so tired, but it's so delicious. Here you go, Molly. Try. Perfect. Well, what a beauty. Oh, where did the spider come from? Take it. Here you go, bastard. Where is it? What? Was that a burger? Wednesday, don't do that again. I'm afraid of spiders. But I'm happy to try the chef's whopper here. How heavy. How do you take a bite of this burger? It's not an easy task. Mm, it's incredibly delicious. There's still those cute burgers from Sophie. They also look unrealistically delicious. I want to eat it as soon as possible. Mmm, so good. They're also sweet. And I love sweets more than anything in the world. Sophie, the victory is yours. Really? Finally! I've been waiting for this moment for so long! 
subscribe to our channel so you don't miss the same delicious and exciting challenges. It will be even more interesting from now on. See you soon!